Hi guys, today we're gonna do a whole body workout. Let's smash the whole body and see what kind of damage we can do today. Come on, let's go have some fun. So I started with single dumbbell squats. To make it more challenging and get more engagement of the body, I stepped on dumbbells. While doing the exercise, I have to balance so the whole system is engaged. I didn't lock my knees, but as you know, locking your knees on heavy workouts can cause joint injury in the long run. So you have to take care of your joints, right? So that's how we went down. Battle rope, another whole body engaging routine, mostly focusing on the shoulders and the core, and of course on your legs. The first attempt of clean and jerk. This is my first attempt of clean and jerk. Great workout to engage your whole body. Since I didn't have kettlebells, I have to go with the plates for swing. So this is a variation of kettlebell swing. Keeping a tight core and pushing from your hip then more power from your system. So it's a great full body workout. And of course, Farmer's walk. Along with your grip strength and forearm strength and every muscle fiber in your body, get an alert to wake up. Just get engaged. It includes the stability, the balance. Put your chest out, keep your body straight, try not to wiggle around, focus, and keep your balance, walk straight. Plate press incorporated with a squat. It's really draining exercise. Like when you're doing a full body workout, you have to make sure to engage more joints. So it's always should be multi-joint workout, multi-joint exercise. So while doing the plank, I move my arms back and forth to make it more challenging so it, I can get more engagement of your core. Then I wrap it up with some jump rope. It's a really great finisher. And cheers and a good workout. Good luck guys. See you next time. Signing off. This is Z.